How is everybody doing today? Okay. Nice snowy day in New England today. Okay. Uh, before I start my class today, I, my students, when I give a class, I always mention things in the news that's going on. And the biggest thing I'm going to mention now is that all the scams that are taking place because of the coronavirus situation. And why I'm bringing it up and mentioning it to you people is, first of all, I'm a private investigator in New York for 40 years, and I'm also in the enforcement, I'm a deputy sheriff. And I'm fo I follow the, these things all the time. But these situations I'm going to explain to you come under self-defense. Again, you, you try to defend yourself because you stay mentally, physically in good shape and everything to fight the virus. But you also have to defend yourself about all these scams that are going on. And I'll tell you, one of the scams, one of the latest ones, uh, is the Better Business Bureau said. There's scams going out there. And they're, they're scams, they're texting. They're texting you on the phone, right? And when they text you on the phone and you answer to it, right, what happens is they get your passwords, they get your account, bank accounts, they can even get money out of your phone, okay? So be aware of any, any scams coming in on the text. Know, I, know who you're texting with. Just don't hit, go in there and hit. Because if not, they, they can get information from you. That's another one. The Better Business Bureau is, is advertising this a lot, putting a warning out because of that. Texting, okay? So, uh, like I said, the main thing is the texting on the phone. That's a big one. Uh, another texting they have is that uh, the veterans, I'm a veteran, right? And I want to mention this about the veterans. There's a scam out there now where they're posing as veterans and they will call you and ask for money and plead and give a sorrow story saying they need money because they did not receive their check that the government was going to send out. And what they'll do is they'll promise you that they'll, when they get the check, they'll give you double the money back. That's another scam that's going on out there on the phone. Okay. So there's the texting scam, now you get the phone scam. The next one is a social media scam that's going on. Right, that UNICEF has put out a warning that they're putting out a scam of telling people to avoid eating certain foods, old foods, and also a scam avoiding ice cream, believe it or not, because it prevents the virus. And the, uh, another scam we got here, this is the big one, door-to-door -door scam. They have a scam now because of coronavirus. They go to the house and they say they represent the CDC, right? the Center for Disease Control, and they want to go in the house and search your house. And when they get in there, they get in the house, they start searching and everything, and looking for valuables or whatever, okay? So I think this all comes under self-defense. So you got to defend yourself, right, also because of schemes, even though we do for martial arts, I mean, I teach it for the physical self-defense. Uh, and there's numbers that you can call if any time anyone comes to the door, call 911. There are numbers that you can call, I'll give you right here. Uh, a, a federal hotline you can call, disaster fraud. And the number is 886-720-5721. 888-6720-5721. And there's a nut you go online, it's called phishing at irs.com. And it's P H I S H I N G at irs.com. And so I think I mentioned these to my students. Okay. Of all the years, I always mention things that are going on. Uh, okay, now I'm going to start with our 60s again. I'm going to do them slow, slow for you so you can pick it up. Okay. Keep a nice slow stance. After a while, you, you should be able to stretch and get lower and lower. And I'm going to do Joe Dine, shoot through. These are the ones we've done right along. We're going to do it like around 10, 15 minutes, okay? I'm going to do them slow. And this is Joe Dine, shoot through, okay? Each, me, San, she, go, loco, she, she, I, she, ku, ju. Each, me, San, she, go, loco, she, she, I, she, ku, ju. Now, how many people went out and walked this morning? 
I already got my 45 minute walk in this morning. So I hope a lot of you people got, got some time in walking today. Okay, Dina. Each, E, San, Shi, Do, Roko, Shi, Shi, Achi, Ku, Ju. Each, E, San, Shi, Do, Roko, Shi, Shi, Achi, Ku, Ju. Yoko to the side. Each, E, San, Shi, Do, Roko, Shi, Shi, Achi, Ku. Coming in strong. Each, E, San, Shi, Do, with your arms straight out. Okay, you can do it this way or you can get, get it out there. You can do it. Okay, Tisho. Each, E, Sa, Chi, Do, Roko, Shi, Shi, Ha, Chi, Ku, Chu. Each, E, Sa, Chi, Do, Roko, Shi, Shi, Ha, Chi, Ku, Chu. Okay, overhead, Each, E, Sa, Chi, Do. Do you realize the people, I do, that don't move their arms at all? I mean, all week, right? They don't take any time to go out to move their arms. And here you are moving. And like I say, as you're young or old, right? You gotta move, you gotta move, you gotta move the body. That's the main thing. Okay, he got me. Now this is a strike. Okay. Each, me, she, go, go, she, she, I, she, cool, she, okay, car. This now is gonna be a block. Each, me. And when you put it down, okay, you don't, you shouldn't have to look. And it, when you use it for self-defense, it should be, it should just be here. Boom, there's the move. You don't need to look. You don't have to look. You don't have to look. It should be instinct. Instinct when you do it. Okay? And another thing I explained it before and I'll mention it again. If you get dust or something in your eye and all of a sudden, okay, this dude should be on you, right? And you get dust in your eye. Well, you don't think about closing your eye because you get dust in the eye. Dust gets in the eye, you close your eye, you say, geez, I got dust in my eye. Uh, th this is how you're supposed to react when you do all your self-defense moves, by the way. Okay? Uh, and again, and I'll give you another good example, a real good one, that everybody can relate to. If you're driving your vehicle, right, you're going down the street, and all of a sudden, a uh, ball comes in front of you, uh, some pedestrian comes right, or someone slams on the brake, then you take your foot off the throttle, and you hit the brake. Now, you do it automatically. You didn't have to think about it, right? You, the minute something happens, you, your reflex is right there. The minute something pulled in front of your car, you, you hit your brake. Well, you didn't think about it. After, after you did it, you think about it. But the minute you did it, you don't think about it. Especially if it's something right in front of you right away. So that's why I'm trying to say. So the thing is, when you do all these techniques, if you have to think about them, if I have to think about them, doing the head of the cannon, doing the strike, not it's too late. And uh, for the self-defense reason, whenever you do these, remember, four or five seconds is usually any counter you're gonna have with anybody you ever use for self-defense. So then you're not gonna be doing like me 20, 30, 40, 100 times, do it more like that. You should gonna do it once. Boom, there it is, one move, right, boom. There is a move, okay? That's what you're gonna have to do, okay? All right, uh, wash your head. Each, me, she, go, roko, she, she, I, she, ku, do. Each, me, she, go, roko, she, she, I, she, ku, ju. Nuki te. Each, me, san, she, go, roko, she, she, I, she, ku, do. Each, me, san, she. Now remember when I told you to do these? Your arm's not stiff. That's it. It isn't stiff, okay? It's loose, like shaking water from here. Here, there you go. Well, that's how the move goes. The same way it's going to go here, right? That's the move. Okay. That's what you can do when you use self-defense. Okay. But you're doing it as exercise. I just want you to do this exercise. At least you know what it is. Okay. That's why I'm explaining as they go along. Okay. You can take. There we go. You can do. See now you can do 10, 20, 30. You can take. 20 minutes and do them, just do as many times as you want, okay? And uh, I've mentioned a lot of people, 
every class that I'm doing, I'm putting on YouTube. So you go there, you can watch something that you didn't learn that talk before. And I'll be doing these classes during the week, right during the week, for the next few more weeks. Other than that, I'll come back to probably like three times a week. I'll do it. But I'm doing it now because uh, I get the time to do it. Okay? Uh, Coco, here we go. Each. San, she, go, Roco, she, she. Two, two, each, me, San, she. Remember Jill was the other day? Each, 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 That's what you're going to be doing after a while, speed, okay? That's what you're doing. Blocks, downward block, rising block. You're there, all of a sudden, someone comes up right there. Boom, boom, boom. Jill showed you that the other day. All right, take it. Each, 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 Rising block. Each, e, fa, chi, go, roco, chi, shi, fa, chi, ku, ju, gira. Each, e, fa, chi, go, roco, chi, shi, fa, chi, ku, ju. Each, e, fa, chi, go, roco, chi, shi, fa, chi, ku. Now that there's the move I just showed you. Block, block, strike. Okay, there it is. Block, block. So I'm there, if something happens, all of a sudden, here I am. There's the move, okay? There's the move. And when that comes back, this one's all ready to do it again. So I'm here, here's the move. One, two, three, four, okay? I'll go right there. All right, I can do a completely different move. I go block, strike, right? I'll do a tracer, right? Okay, strike, okay? I just want to get these. That's how they're going to be used as a self-defense, okay? All right. Uh, Okay, so here, right here, here, right here. Bring your elbow, get your elbow right here, get it right here. So anything's here, punch comes in, here, the shoulder comes in, because you're moving. The minute that punch comes in, it comes here, you go here, you go here, you go here, you go here. But the whole idea, and the thing is when you do it, you don't even think all of a sudden, there's the move, there's the move. You had to think about it was too late, okay? Think about it was too late. Each, e, ta, chi, go, roca, shi, shi, ha, chi, ku, ju. Each, e, ta, chi, go, roca, shi, shi, ha, chi, ku, ju. Okay. Uh, let's do uh, high jump. Each, e, ta, chi, go, roca, shi, shi, ha, chi, ku, ju. Each, e, ta, chi, go. Now, when you notice that Joe and I do them, you watch, we do them, we say, we sync with each other, but we're doing them for the moves. It's, it's just, we, we do them so it's just a habit, right? So anytime you're walking, you're walking right this here, right here, right here, right here. There's the move, right there. Boom, come right up. Right there. Okay? H, D, Ka, Chi, Ko, 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 Chi, Chi, Ha, Chi, Ku. So when I do the 60s, we know we get down the stance, see me do it. But in a real situation, you wouldn't be down the stairs to do it. The only time you get down in that type of stairs is if someone was throwing a punch, right? And it came in, and when you did ties it back, you explained to you, you come in here, boom, get it out of the way, and you want to get down because this guy's punching, right? So once you come in, you're gonna come in here, you're gonna come in, block, 
and the strike boom. You can throw a kick. Okay, that's what you're going to do. That's all I'm going to cover later. Okay, but I'm just <coughs> I'm just showing you get to do it. Okay, here we go. Empty. <coughs> Eat me. Tap. T. Go. Okay. <coughs> there we go. Right. Empty. Remember, just throw it over your head. Throw it over your head. Right. <coughs> it doesn't have to look pretty. Okay. It doesn't. Yes, yeah, go. Yeah, it's a. Yeah, it's a. <coughs> just throw it over your head. Yeah, right here. Okay. Eat. Eat. Okay, Yoko is Yoko. Now, I'm down here doing it, but in a real situation, someone can come grab you. You just, you just want to come. You come right now. You just, you just go right now. You go right now. And when you come around, you get to come around, block, and go right into, into another movie that I went to. Okay? Uh, <clears throat> you should have. Each. You should be picking these up, because I've been doing them now for like a few weeks. Okay? Remember, you go on YouTube, you go to what I did, I explained a little more on the moves so you get it down. I just want you to do this exercise, okay? <clears throat> That's what I want to do. I want to get you people that aren't doing anything, right? Or even people aren't doing it, I'm just showing you some techniques, right? But the thing is, to get moving, I just want you to get moving, okay? <clears throat> All right. Go, 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 she, she, you, okay. Joe down here, we can't hit you, right here. Oh, <coughs> first come down. I come down here. H, D, Na, C, Go, Rock, C, C, Pachi, Ku, Ju. Now, the thing, punch comes in, I'm just going to get out of the way, and I'm going to back and strike. So I'll be right there. Boom, boom. There's the move. There's the move. So we're going to punch, right? Boom, boom. I'm right back, okay? H, <coughs> D, Na, C, now I might do it one time. I'm there all of a sudden throws a Boom, boom, I'm just gonna come just come right back, back here. And the minute when I come back here, boom, here, and then I'm gonna do a kick. Okay? And just get out of there. Okay. Alright. Do it. Each me. She go. Broke. She she hachi. Ku. Ju. Eat. Me. She go. Broke. She she. Okay. Now that technique was when the, I saw you, I, I might go into a stand in a real situation. If a guy can move the punch, he's coming right here. I might just come right here, boom, block it out of the way. I go into my stand, right? But once I do that, I come in and block, take my empty here, right here, get it right here, and this comes back right in the face. So the move's going to be here, here, here. One, two, three. One move, that's it. One move. But you're doing them. You're already DMP. You're doing the back end. You're doing the back end. Right? And the stage stand, too. Got, fine, I can just stand normal and come in and do it. Boom, boom, boom. Right? But if it's a big guy, I want to get down. I'm going to come right in here. Boom, 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 boom. Go right in. Okay? That's what I'm going to do. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> we'll watch the MP. Each knee. Uh, T, go, roll, go, T, touch it, coop, eat, E, T, T, go, roll, go, T, T, touch it, coop, T, okay. Now I do, we practice this here, Tatios, Hedekins, and Seikens, here. That's, with that move, we practice it there, because when you use it, there would be a situation where someone threw something, right? Two something, came right in, take him down, I come right in here. One, two, down, he's down. In the minute he's down, do you, you want to go, you want to do striking as you do. Okay? Uh, now I do the judo, do the karate, the kido, the weapons, philosophy, I do all of it, okay? In fact, I just started doing judo when I was 13. That's how far I go back with you. I love the judo. I can't imagine being in a situation <coughs> without the guys on the ground, because it's just automatic to me. No matter how someone come up, grab, boom, 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 I'm going to throw, drop, or sweep. I'll drop. Uh, one new technique we started yesterday, crescent kick. Yeah. Now, when you do it, you stand here, but in normal situation, you wouldn't. But it's going to be here, you just bring it up here. 
There's more. Right there. Beautiful technique. Yeah, ready. Yeah, so I'm ready. Yeah, so, okay. Now you say, what is that for? Well, let me tell you what it's for. If someone pulls a knife on you, someone's a buddy, got a knife, someone pulls a knife, boom. I'm right there, boom. There's the knife, boom. Just hit. And if you hit just right, you pull right here, boom, and I'm, whole shoulder comes down, you come in here. I go, boom, right? Right there. And then after you get the knife out of the way, here, then come out, and you do it. Okay. I'm showing you some bad stuff because it's sad to me. Uh, let me see what else we got here today. I think that's pretty good for today. I want to mention my philosophy <clears throat> today. Okay. <clears throat> I mentioned this before. Okay. Life is short. If you can't laugh at yourself, call me and I'll laugh at you. Okay, I figured I'd do that. Listen to you. Okay. Uh, real growth is when you start checking and connecting yourself. Instead of blaming others, you take the power by being responsible for your own life. Okay? And with this comes right into play today. Because with all these scams and everything going on, people are losing millions and millions and millions of dollars. Okay? And you are the one that's losing the money. Okay? If you got a scam, you go online, you text, you get into one of these scams. I hear about it all the time. Right? As an investigator, I had a guy remember come from Pennsylvania was up here in that scam, coming up here with the money. Right? He got involved in the scam. He went online. And uh, I've had a lot of cases where that's happened. So I'm just telling you, that's why right here, take your power by being responsible. In other words, with me, I'm going to tell you what I do. Okay? If there's anything, I have any question, right? I've had it even come from my own bank, professionally on my own bank, saying information, this and all that. And I would call the bank, and they should know it's not us. Everything, the same emblem, the same look, everything is with the bank, right? Positive, what is Sam with the two? Sam is going to give me money, and money go in the account, or this, or money, or your accounts, the overdraw, anything, and I, I, I won't even respond to it. What I do is I call the bank, and I make sure I have the bank number to call it, right? I don't call a number to anywhere I pick up. I know that that's my bank, I know the number. And the best thing to do for everyone to protect yourself, right, is that on your credit card, they have a number right there on the credit card, right? Anytime you have a problem, you call on your credit card. Call right there, and they usually answer right away. It might be on a few seconds, might hold you on, and just tell them what's going on. And I'm gonna tell you, probably out of 10 times, I have people contact me with scams, right? Everything from calling the phone, social security, text, all that. Every time I go to verify it, because being an investigator, that's my, that's my natural thing I would do, investigate it. It's a fraud. It's, it is. Like I say, so I'm just passing it on to you. Yeah. And I had, I had uh, my daughter, my sister called me once, right, on the phone crying, because the IRS called and told her she had to come up with so much money by the end of the day. Right, crying and all that. I finally had to yell at her, I said, hey, Stop crying, would you listen to me? I explained to her what's a fraud. Right? So I just want you to know, I hope you people get the idea today. Self-defense means defend against everything, okay? But the coronavirus is causing a lot of these people to come out of the woodwork to take advantage of people because of this. So uh, have a rest of the weekend, enjoy it, and God bless everybody. Thank you.